Hello, this is G-Man, and I am back, and I'm bringing you a game of the new Medal of Honor open beta on PC, uh, just to tide you over until the, the actual game comes out in, like, what, four days? So, yeah, this is the first game hosted up in a long time, because I've been moving house, and moving into university, and all this other stuff. But then this beta came out, and I thought, you know, I better get some footage out, because I've had... A few subscribers uh, subscribed to my channel, no, a few new subscribers on my channel in the past couple weeks, and I feel bad because I have, what, like, nearly 90 subscribers now or something like that, and I haven't posted up anything for ages, so I'm giving back to the community. <laughs> so yeah, this is a game of, of sector control, I believe it's called, on Kunar Base, and this is basically domination and it's uh, a game type which wasn't in the previous beta so it's pretty cool to see you know to be able to play new game types and see the changes they've made to the the game since the last beta and stuff so this is this is good i like this <laughs> uh yeah so you can see this is a new map it's um it's a small one it's like on a mountain top and basically you just have to control the flags and you can see in the bottom left you got your points counter and it's the first team to to 1800 points I think and so you play it just like domination I mean you can capture two and I think if you leave one spawn you can see where everyone you'll, you'll know where everyone spawns on the opposite team and so and so you can basically spawn trap them but you know I, I was still getting used to this this is one of the first games that I played on this beta it's one of the only games I got to record actually I guess um, <laughs> It's pretty embarrassing. Uh, my girlfriend commandeered my PC for the past few days to play The Sims 3, and <laughs> I've only just been able to get it back. Um, I know I should I should keep pimp hands strong, really. And so yeah, uh, the beta had finished by the time I got back to it. So I only have a few d games to post, but I'll do them day by day so that you know I don't suffocate them with each other, if that makes sense. And also it'll um. It'll serve nicely, like, kind of one per day until the game comes out. So, yeah. Uh, some of the changes they've made. Uh, they've got rid of the orange gradient thing that pops up when whenever you get points. They've changed it to white, and I think it looks a lot better for it. Uh, obviously, someone at EA saw my last video. Um, that's the way I'm going to think about it, anyway. Because, <laughs> uh, yeah, I complained about that on my last video. I just thought it looked really lame, and so they've changed it. Uh, one of the other things they've changed is, well, <laughs> as you can see right there, um, they've made it fucking laggy. <laughs> um, no, I'm just, I'm just joking. It's not. Um, I don't think it's the game's fault. It's obviously a server problem, but you know the the server browser wasn't working in this open beta, which is worrying because that was one of the things that was wrong with the last game, the, the last beta even. The the server browser just didn't work. It crash a lot and. Um, it's kind of worrying since it comes out in four days. <laughs> uh, but yeah, some of the what are, what other changes have they made? They've oh, they've renamed the Taliban. <laughs> you might have seen this on the news. They've they've renamed the Taliban to opposing force. And <laughs> and no, it's, there's been a, a lot of controversy around it. And I can kind of understand why they don't want any negative press surrounding the game around their release when they're um obviously trying to go up against Call of Duty, but, you know, I don't see how it's much different to, uh, you know, playing as the Nazis in World at War, and, you know, millions of people died th in in that whole thing, and they've they've turned it into a multiplayer gaming experience, so, I don't know, I think, I think it was purely a PR thing just to, you know, get in everyone's good books again, maybe, I don't know, I'm not going to go as far as to say it's for publicity, so, <laughs> You know, I'm staying out of the whole politics thing. But you can see here, like, how, how much this guy is struggling with the lag. Uh, it's not so bad in this video, but other videos, you can... You know, you can you can tell that shots are landing way after I've, I've shot them. Uh, but yeah, what else do I have to talk about in this video? Um, my mind is kind of going blank. I've, I haven't done one of these commentaries in ages, and I just... I don't know, I have that Hayley Williams song stuck in my head. 
that's that's all I can think about right now. Um, yeah, I've. What have I done since my last videos? I've upgraded my PC like a lot. So I have I have new graphics cards. I should do a setup video really. Uh, that's that's something I could do. Um, I plan on getting a load of a load load more videos of Medal of Honor once the actual game comes out. I'll try and make that my focus for the next couple of weeks. Get some good content up. And yeah, that's that's all I can say really. I um I hope people enjoy this game, and I hope they don't um. Yeah, that's something I could talk about really. I I hope that they don't that people when they buy this game they don't instantly compare it to Call of Duty because that's how they've been marketing it. They've everywhere's been calling it like a potential COD killer and stuff, and I don't think that's a really good move. I mean, you're putting it up against the number one selling game franchise, you know, in in the world. I think uh, so. You know, to that's that's not a good way to look at it. I I hope people enjoy this game for what it is, and yeah, I think I'm coming to the end of this video now. So I'll save I'll save that for the next video. I uh, hope you enjoy this one. I hope, as always, people comment, rate, and subscribe, and look forward to the next videos, guys. Um, can't wait for this game to come out. I think it's going to be fucking awesome. Uh, yeah, and here we go. This is the end of the game. It, it was an amazing one, but you know we won in six and a half minutes, which is one of the faster ones that I've done, I think. And I think I got a score of 18 to three. Uh, you should be able to see it here. It gives you like a, a roundup afterwards, uh, and then throws you straight into the next game. So I'll see you next time, guys. Watch out for the next one.